my books um, today. I just want, I just have to tell you to buy, to go out and buy the Battlefield One Deluxe Pack just for um, the map called Fort Vaux. It's um, I've only been able to play Capture the Flag, but oh my days, it is absolutely amazing. Um, I didn't. I was to be honest with the original maps from Battlefield One. They're okay. I mean, nothing too exciting, nothing too amazing. It got a bit samey after a while because I've been, I've probably stacked in probably 150 hours already in Battlefield One. But Fort Vaux, oh my god, um, it's um, set in a kind of like a fort. If you want, yeah, stupid question, but yeah, it is in a fort and it is internal corridors, external kind of deserted wastelands with pitted um, bombs, uh, bombed. Um, holes and mouth and all that kind of stuff but um, I, I, I'll put money that this is going to be a very popular map when it's going to be released um, as the full DLC in a couple of weeks I think um, it's a fairly size fairly big size map um, we know being the CTE only lets you play um, uh, capture the flag or, co or conquest uh, with 64 players but with 64 players the map is big enough so that um, you can have swarmed gunfights where there's usually about 20 on 20 people with, with and it's absolute chaos but uh, every so often you can have one-to-one -one encounters through through just trying to find a random person um, running around by himself and that can be quite engaging as well because there's lots of places to hide lots of tactics lots of um, um, corridors and different routes to attack someone so if you're really sneaky you go around and uh, give them one from behind that's not what I meant anyway um, but, but with this map it's, it's fantastic because there's not just one type of gun play or of play you can do you can have um, you can do um, long range defensive because um, many of the flags you can see from freaking you know well, not miles, that's not the right word, but you can see for a great distance, so anyone approaching you, you can um, you know, pick them up quite easily, but each flag has multiple um, routes, which makes um, attacking and defending um, very frantic, uh, certainly when the, you know people are just running around in a swarm, but um, the only negative I'd have to say is there's a lot of nade spamming, so um, dodging grenades is a skill that you are going to have to learn. But other than that, I like I said, I thoroughly, 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 thoroughly recommend this game, um, this DLC. Um, go and get it now. I'm not sponsored. I'm just, I'm just having time of my life. Okay, I gotta go. Bye.